teenagers. They can be exciting, confusing, and sometimes downright baffling. One minute they're laughing, the next they're slamming doors. Understanding why teenagers act the way they do can feel like solving a mystery. But just like any mystery, it's solvable. By understanding the psychological changes happening in their brains and lives, we can bridge the communication gap and build stronger relationships. Imagine this. You're trying to have a conversation with a teenager about cleaning their room, and it erupts into a full-blown argument. Frustrating, right? But what if we viewed this situation through the lens of their developing brain? Suddenly, their outburst might make more sense. The teenage years are a period of incredible transformation, not just physically, but mentally and emotionally as well. Their brains are undergoing a massive rewiring process, hormones are surging, and they're trying to figure out who they are in the world. By understanding these changes, we can better support teenagers as they navigate this challenging and exciting phase of life. We can learn to communicate more effectively, build stronger relationships, and help them develop into healthy, well-adjusted adults. The teenage years are marked by a whirlwind of psychological changes that shape who they are becoming. It's like they're undergoing a complete mental makeover from the inside out. One of the most significant changes is the development of their sense of self. Teenagers start to question everything they've been taught, exploring their own beliefs, values, and interests. They become more aware of how others see them and start to worry about their image and identity. This exploration is a natural part of growing up, but it can also lead to confusion and insecurity. Another major shift is the increasing desire for independence. Teenagers naturally want more freedom and control over their lives, whether it's choosing their own clothes, spending more time with friends, or making their own decisions. This push for independence can sometimes lead to conflict with parents or caregivers who are used to having more control. Alongside these changes comes a greater capacity for abstract thinking. Teenagers begin to think more critically and question the world around them. They're able to see different perspectives, understand complex concepts, and engage in more sophisticated conversations. This newfound ability to think abstractly allows them to grapple with bigger questions about life, morality, and their place in the world. However, these psychological shifts can also make teenagers more vulnerable to emotional ups and downs. Their moods might swing more dramatically and they may experience intense feelings of anxiety, frustration, or sadness. These emotional fluctuations are a normal part of adolescence, but it's essential to provide them with support and understanding during these times. Imagine your brain as a house undergoing major renovations. Walls are being torn down, new rooms are being built, and the electrical wiring is getting a complete overhaul. That's a pretty accurate picture of what's happening inside a teenager's head. The teenage brain is a work in progress and these neurological changes have a big impact on their behavior. One of the most significant changes is the development of the prefrontal cortex, the part of the brain responsible for planning, decision-making, and impulse control. Think of it as the brain's control panel. During adolescence, this area is still under construction, which explains why teenagers sometimes struggle with things like thinking ahead, making rational decisions, and controlling their impulses. Another important change is the increase in activity in the limbic system, the emotional center of the brain. This area is responsible for processing emotions like joy, sadness, anger, and fear. During adolescence, the limbic system is on high alert, which can make teenagers more sensitive and reactive to emotional triggers. This combination of a developing prefrontal cortex and a highly active limbic system can sometimes lead to risky or impulsive behavior. It's not that teenagers are trying to be difficult, their brains simply aren't always equipped to fully grasp the potential consequences of their actions.